Opinion, the loudest voices against women suffrage were women too to view the full article, click the first link in the description below. Nicole Hammer is an associate research scholar at Columbia University with the Obama Presidency Oral History Project and the author of Messengers of the Right, Conservative Media and the Transformation of American Politics. She co-hosts the history podcast Past Present and This Day and Esoteric Political History. The views expressed in this commentary are solely those of the author. View more opinion articles on CNN. The arguments echo those that had been made for decades. The pro-suffragists insisted women's vote would improve the lives of women and children and fulfill the American promise of self-government, the anti-suffragists warned that it would lead to open warfare between men and women, destroying families across the country. While the debates were not unusual, the setting was, the Women's University Club. All the attendees, and debaters, were women, including the ones arguing against women's suffrage. Suffragist Fanny Garrison Villar, identified in the New York Times only as Mrs. Henry Villar. After what has been done for them in the way of education it ill becomes them. The women who opposed women's right to vote have often been left out of the story of suffrage, not only because they were on the losing side, but also because it's hard to know what to make of them. They're not laughable villains like male anti-suffragists, conspiring to keep women in a state of second-class citizenship while hogging all the rights for themselves. Even the pro-suffragists at the university club spoke of them more with pity than contempt. It saddens me, I confess. When I meet women who are exerting themselves to oppose suffrage, said Villar voiced a perspective, that women should know better than to oppose their own rights, that persisted long after American women formally secured the right to vote in 1920. As reactions to the popular miniseries Mrs. America and the 2016 election returns attest, many Americans remain fascinated Nicole Hammer is an associate research scholar at Columbia University with the Obama Presidency Oral History Project and the author of Messengers of the Right. Conservative Media and the Transformation of American Politics She co-hosts the history podcast Past Present and This Day in Esoteric Political History To view the full article, click the first link in the description below.